Hello, I'm Aubrey, a cloud support engineer here at the AWS office in Cape Town, South Africa. Today I'm going to show you how to create Amazon CloudWatch alarms to monitor your Amazon Relational Database Service for SQL Server Database Instance Memory Consumption using Enhanced Monitoring. Let's get started. First, we must get the name and the resource ID of the database instance that we want to create the alarm for. After logging on to the AWS Management Console, navigate to the Amazon RDS Console. Choose Databases. Select the instance that you want to monitor. Navigate to the Configuration tab. Scroll down and note the resource ID and instance name. We'll use this information later on. Now navigate to the CloudWatch console. Then select log groups in the navigation pane. Now filter for RDS OS metrics in the log groups. Select RDS OS metrics by choosing RDS OS metrics. Navigate to Metrics Filters and click the Create Metric Filter button. Now we must specify a filter pattern for the metric that we want to monitor. In this example, we'll filter the instance name that we obtained earlier. To do this, enter the following in the Filter Pattern box. From the Select Log Data to Test drop-down list, select the instance resource ID that we obtained earlier. Choose Next and enter a filter name. Enter a metric namespace and metric name. For this scenario, we'll use EM metric as the namespace and SQL Server Memory Consumption as the metric name. Under Metric Value, enter the following. Then choose Next. Choose Create Metric Filter to create the custom metric that we specified. Doing this will report this data in a CloudWatch graph. Now let's create an alarm for the metric. We can do this by selecting the new metric that we created and then choose the Create Alarm button. In the metric section, verify the namespace and metric name and then set the period to 1 minute. In the condition section, specify the condition that will trigger the alarm. For our example, let's configure the alarm to send an alert when the SQL Server memory consumption exceeds 20 GB. To do this, select the greater than threshold and enter a value of 20048576. Note that this value is in kilobytes. Choose Next. Now we present it with the action section. For the purpose of this video, we'll just be triggering an alarm and email notification. For now, select alarm. You can also select to use an existing topic or create a new one. In this case, we'll be creating a new SNS topic. We can do so by choosing create new topic. Give the topic a unique name like RDS memory consumption. Then enter the email address where you want the alert to go to. Then choose Create Topic. You'll see that the configuration changes to select an existing topic with the new topic that you just created. Go ahead and choose Next. We'll just finish off by giving the alarm a proper name and description. When you've done that, choose Next. Finally, choose Create Alarm. Now that the alarm is created, you can view it under Alarms in the CloudWatch console. After your alarm enters an alarm state, you'll receive an email notification similar to this. So now you know how to create CloudWatch alarms to monitor your Amazon RDS for SQL Server database instance memory consumption using enhanced monitoring. Thanks for watching and happy cloud computing from all of us here at AWS.